Good morning, everyone. This is Tina from Earth and Bone Art Studio, and I am actually in my studio today. And, well, I am in here every day, actually. <laughs> um, but I thought I would share what I'm up to right now. I've actually got a few projects on the go. Um, as you can see by the mess that is on my workspace area. But right now in this moment, I'm actually reworking this Earth Mother painting that I had completed not that long ago, but she's been really calling me. I've been staring at her. She's been sitting in my studio with me here for a few weeks now. And I just wanted to put her back on the easel. So um, that's what I've done. I do apologize if you hear some construction noise in the background. My neighbor is resurfacing their driveway. So unfortunately, it is what it is. Um, but in any case, this is what I have been working on. I don't know if you remember what she looks like before. Um, I might actually show a before photo of her. Her hair was brown and it had some vines and everything. You can actually still see some of it right here. And this was actually kind of going all here and her hair was all brown. So I've actually done a few things with her hair today because I was undecided. And one was just a bunch of brush strokes and different colors just coming down on either side of her head. And I did that and I actually shared a little tiny picture of that, a photo of that, um, earlier today in my Instagram. But I decided it was too busy and I didn't quite like that. It was one of those things where I stood back from the easel and I thought, what the heck did I just do there? But no, no big deal. I was able to just paint over it. So which is what I did. So she's now got black hair and I'm not sure what I'm going to do in this space, but for now, um, this is where it is. Done some more outlining here. And I did some more detail up here and added little hints of color. She already had the blue and I don't know if you can tell because the lighting, there's a glare here from the sun coming in, but um, I added some red in here as well and some more other colors here. Some reds here, some greens, a little bit more detail here. There's the red and the green being introduced again. And yeah, so I'm really, really loving this painting. It's, it's just, you know, sometimes we just have one of those paintings that we do, um, or at least that I do anyway. I shouldn't speak for everybody. And it just speaks to me. And originally I had this one up in my website for sale. I, of course, took it off because I was changing her and tweaking her a bit. But sometimes we get ones that really speak to us and it's, it's beyond personal. And there's so much in this of me um, that I've put into this painting that I, I, I'm, I might have to keep it for myself. I'm trying to resist the wanting to keep it for myself, but I just may end up doing that. But in any case, I just wanted to show you what was going on in my studio. Um, so I have that and I have a few other paintings here uh, that I have going on here. This one's actually completed. Um, I took her down off the wall because I was putting her, taking photos of her for prints. That one, if you recall, I shared a little while ago. And this one here, I'm not sure. I might end up... <laughs> I said to my husband the other day that this one feels like she needs a daisy or something coming out of the top of her head. So I got a weird look with that, <laughs> with that suggestion, of course. But I don't know, she, she might still end up getting a flower coming out of the top of her head because she looks very serious. And just to make her less serious, I might do something like that, but we will see. In any case, I hope you all have a wonderful day or are having a wonderful day. And um, until next time.